Welcome everyone, you may be trying to upgrade to iOS 16 and when you go to the software update page, you see this message. Unable to check for update, if you tap on try again, nothing is working. Alright, so let's try the first fix. The first fix is you're going to open up the settings app, then you're going to tap on general, then you're going to find VPN, you're going to tap into this one, and if you have any VPNs, make sure you turn them off. If for some reason the VPN is auto reconnecting, then there'll be an I button, tap on the I and then turn off connect on demand. Next, I want you to go to the Wi-Fi settings. You're going to tap on the I, you're going to scroll down until you see configure proxy, tap into this one and make sure this is set to off. You may have a proxy which is blocking the Apple servers, so turning that off will solve the issue. Now, if those didn't work, what I want you to do is I want you to go to general, iPhone storage and check your storage. If you're low on storage, maybe one to two gigs, you really need seven to eight gigs free on your iPhone in order for things to work smoothly. So if you're having issues, just free up storage and that should help out. If you tried all those things, uh, before we go into the nitty gritty, I want you to do a restart of your iPhone. So in order to restart, load up settings, then find general, and you'll see here shut down, tap on shut down. So let's do that right now. You will see slides power off. So you slide the power off, then hold the power button until you see the Apple logo, release the power button, and your iPhone will restart. If that did not work, and you are still getting the unable to check for update issue like I am, then the issue is with your device itself. So we can solve it, that's okay. Uh, the issue is, is you jailbroke, okay? So maybe this is a used iPhone uh, from eBay, you bought it and it had the issue, uh, that previous owner jailbroke your device, or... This was your device, you jailbroke it with a jailbreak utility. And so these jailbreak utilities, they'll block the software updates, but you can re-enable them. So it's very simple. I want you to load up the jailbreak tool you used in the past. Then you want to find settings. So we'll go into settings here. And you should see here this feature, restore rootfs. You're going to turn this one on. And then you see automatic updates. You have enabled restore rootfs, while automatic updates are blocked. Would you want to re-enable automatic updates? Just tap on yes, and you can see block auto updates will turn off. From here, we'll go to done, and we'll tap on restore rootfs. Just wait for this to finish. Once it finishes, it will restart your device. If this fails, it gives you an error message or something like that. You will have to go into your jailbreak utility and just tap and you know follow the same process until this here succeeds without any errors. And once you do that, it should solve the issue. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut to once this runs. Okay, so let's slide out of this and you can see complete. If you see completed, that means we're good to go. So we'll just restart the device. And after the restart, everything should be working. Uh, we should be able to check for updates again. So let's see. Okay, the restart is finished. Let's take a look. So let's go to settings and then we'll go to general. So for update and let's see if software updates are showing up. So I don't have the iOS 16 beta profile, which is why I see iOS 15. If you're watching when iOS 16 is the public, well, of course, um, well, I'm doing this when iOS 15 is the public. But um, yeah, you can see the issue has been solved without fail. If you watched this far, you tried everything and things are not working, then the only solution is you're going to have to do software updates via uh, iTunes and the firmware file. So if you need to do that, just go to itunes.apple.com on your computer and connect your device to the computer and there'll be an update button tap on it and you're good to go all right that's all there is to it thanks for watching see you guys later bye bye